Hello, Hopedale. Hey, we're here with this month's winner of the Employee of the Month Award. This is Mindy Peterson Lindsay. Hi, Mindy. Hello, Scott. How are you, dear? Good, how are you? I'm um, wonderful. Congratulations Thank on you. winning this month. I know you did a lot of lobbying. Oh, you I ran did. a good campaign. <laughs> Thank you. I try my best. <laughs> you can slap me later. It's okay. okay. No one minds. Um, so I want to read your nomination, which was written by me, which well, she paid me a little something, but that doesn't hurt. Um, I'd like to nominate Mindy Peterson Lindsay for Employee of the Month. Mindy is always going above and beyond to help anyone who asks. She works great with everyone and consistently has a smile on her face and, and a positive attitude. Mindy does amazing work and has an eye for detail and does her best in everything she does. She takes great pride in her work with the volunteers and with the gift shop and with her job with the marketing team. She is absolutely what an ideal HMC employee should look like. We only hope that she stays here forever. Thank you. I think just about everybody, if not everybody, feels that way about you. Well, I appreciate that. We love having you here. So, um, tell us something we don't know. How did you get here? Um, I got married and my husband worked at Caterpillar and Morton. So I wanted to find something closer to home because home for us is my near. And HMC had an opening for a volunteer coordinator position and that's how I found out about Hopedale Medical Complex. And how many years ago was that? Um, it's been a little over four years now. Is that right? It has been. That is wonderful. Thank you. I mean, you've done a lot in four years. It has been uh, challenging, but yet I uh, feel like we've done some worthwhile things. So what's the, what's the funnest part that you've done since you've been here? What's the best thing or the thing that maybe you enjoy the most? I think it's the opportunity to be able to work with so many people in different departments. So a lot of times people work in their same department and they don't get to work with other people on campus. And with my job, I have an opportunity to work with almost every department. So are, are two days ever the same here for you? No, never. Two, two hours are never the same here. <laughs> So you wouldn't want to work on a, a factory line and build cars or I anything like that? I definitely could not do that. I don't no. blame you. I don't blame you a bit. Um, so where before that did you work where maybe you could develop your people skills and your organizational skills? Sure. Before here, I worked at University of Illinois Extension um, in Macon, <laughs> Pyatt, and DeWitt County. And I did um, community and economic development with them and also marketing. Is that right? Yep. So before that, what did you do? Oh my gosh. Let's go way back to high school, college years. How did things oh, come together? Those were the best jobs, right? It wasn't that long ago. No, it was, thank you, 10 bucks. <laughs> I winked at the camera. <laughs> um, when I was in high school, I worked um, at a home with uh, individuals that had de developmental disabilities. I oh. worked in the kitchen there, so I started out in the kitchen. Wow. And then, believe it or not, when I was um, in high school, I worked at a full service gas station, and I was a cashier. So. That's where you develop good working skills, good people skills. <laughs> yes. It's the truth. Thank you. People, yeah, that's, that's wonderful. So who do you think here has helped to shape you into what you've become here right now? Um, I think there's a couple people that stand out for me. Um, Kathy Roach as a manager, I watch her with her employees and I'm always impressed and, and I think that that is amazing. Um, Shirley Tanner in the kitchen. Wonderful. I think she is a phenomenal employee and she just makes me want to be a better person all the way around. Those are two great people to be with. So before that, let's say somebody else in your life that maybe helped form your skills, that maybe encouraged you, maybe it was a mentor, something like that. I think that all the credit should go to my parents and grandparents because they have made me the person I am, showed me the work ethic that I do have, and nobody else should get that credit but them. I think. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's pretty neat. So right now, what are the best parts of your job? You said you like working with different departments. Is there anything else that you like doing? You did such a great job at the Christmas stuff. It, was, it really was remarkable. I think for me, it's just working with the community <clears throat> and working with our volunteers. Um, I, can't, I can't say it enough. Um, our volunteers, we've missed them this year, not have them, and it's exciting to know that in the near future, hopefully we'll see a lot of them back because they really are passionate about not only the community, but Hopedale Medical Complex as a whole. It's just a, a very unique place. I mean, I found that you know, over the, the years I've been here, there, there's, nothing, there's no other place like this. No, I don't think we, I think we do a great job of continuum of care um, sure. from the minute you walk in the door to the, to the minute you walk out. And I think that we stand out with that. And I am, I'm proud to be a part of that and to know what happens here at HMC and how well people are treated. We are a good leader oh. and good leaders lead. 
and that's really important. So what do you see for us coming up? What are exciting things in 21 that are going to happen? Hopefully we're going to get the chapel done. <laughs> I'll be really excited about that. I'm excited about some new marketing things that we're working on to showcasing some of the unique departments here and departments that we don't see a lot of um, and showcase them and also showcase our employees and the great work that they do yeah. um, and show how they connect with our patients, our residents, and how staff members connect with one another. I think that makes it most important and uh, I'm excited to be able to showcase that too. That's fantastic. Now HMC is a great place to work. We all feel that way but you are a very important pillar of that and we appreciate that. Well thank you very much. I think everybody does a wonderful job and I'm just one little piece of the puzzle. <laughs> <laughs> or there's a lot of pieces around here. That's true. Congratulations Mindy on Employee of the Month for December. Thank you.